And now we are moving to fight number seven. We are, the category is 80 kilograms. The rule set, KWU full contact. Your referee, senpai, Mr. Nikolai Atanaso. And now, please welcome, in the red corner, from Estonia, Michael Astur. Michael Astur once again stepping in the ring of Senshi, 26 years of age, Wako K1 World Championship bronze medalist and K1 European Championship silver medalist. He has also Michael won the Megdan Fighting Championship in the 81 kilogram division. Pardon? Megdan, I was one time in Megdan. Yeah. <laughs> Serbia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Serbia. A long time ago, like 35 years ago. His opponent is uh, Serbian, Nikola Todorovic. We're going to introduce him also. I trained with him once at the camps here. He, he knocked me down with a liver punch. <laughs> so he's solid for sure. Yeah, but a good, good boxer from those countries. Yeah. Very different in body types. Michael Astor is a bit uh, longer, lankier guy with uh, long limbs, not so much uh, muscular and stocky. While Nico Filipovic, although he's also really tall, is a bit, uh, is a bit more One muscular. More Make some noise for the Red Corner and Estonia, presented by Michael Astor. Now his opponent from Serbia in the blue corner, Nikola Todorovic. Excuse me, his opponent are not Filipovic, Nikola Todorovic from Serbia. He is also a veteran in the ring of Senshi, five fights he has in the ring of Senshi. Waku Pro World Champion in K1, 78 kilogram division. Also, also Serbia professional kickboxing champion. And he has also won the title of Megdan FC in his home country. One more time, make some noise for the blue corner and Nikola. Todorovic from Serbia! Nikola Todorovic, two years younger. They are both the same height and the same weight. Todorovic faced very tough opposition in the ring of Senshi, the face of Alex Edward Alexanian, Sergey Brown, Christian Korunchev. Nice job by Todorovic. He starts with a bang right away. He wants to make his opponent respect him right away. Solid block by Todorovic, now a classic left hook in a right low kick. Astur is backed up to the corner, defending, trying to counter with hooks and jabs, now throws a knee. Solid right hand by Astro, just as Nico was throwing a punch. Good level changes by Todorovic. That was difficult, like the pressure like this. 
Yeah. Todorovic is one of those fighters that keep on marching forward non-stop. Doesn't matter of what. Yeah, I don't want to run. It costs a lot of pounds. Because you have to work. Close this. Oh, a nice combination. It looks like Astur was rocked here. Now a nice right hand and a punch to the body by Todorovic. All the other pressure. There's a lot of power. Because you have to work, he's coming all the time. Yes, know? yes. You have to work all the time. <laughs> <laughs> For sure, uh, Michael Astor in his preparation has studied Nikola Todorovic and he knows that he has to circle left and right in order to avoid avoid the pressure. Oh, now a nice front oh, kick to the head. And this is the end of round one. KW full contact on the 80 kilograms bout. Nikola Todorovic versus Michael Astur. Both of them really tall, really strong, well conditioned. Nikola, I think he is a blue car, he is a Yes. Michael Astor needs to make some adjustments now with his corner man if he wants to win the second round. So far, he is disciplined in defense, he hasn't received too many significant punches. Definitely made us to fall down a little bit. Solid kicks now by Michael Astor here. Now a nice jumping knee by Nikola Todorovic. He's really patient and calculated with his attacks. But when he goes for it, really, he really goes for it. Oh, that was a good left hand. Oh, that was a slip. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I like it that uh, yeah. Nikola Atalanso doesn't really need to yeah. intercept yeah. and intervene. Ooh, that was nice jumping attack. Separated by Nikola Atalanso again. He gives a warning to McAllister not to push with his elbows or his forearms. Ooh, that was a nice solid right overhand by Nikola Todorovic. Michael Astro seems one of those fights that fighters that it's really hard to score 
It's really hard to find an opening and a crack in his defense. He's very disciplined in defense. That was a nice low kick here inside of the knee of Ice Tour that really rocked him. Again inside of the knee, kicking Nikola Todorovic. Losing the balance, Michael Astur. All those uh, fallings and getting ups are really uh, using a lot of energy away for uh, yeah, you all have to this game. As when you go forward, it's much more easy and much more yeah. easy. Going backwards costs a lot of power. All the time, the pressure. And this is the end of round two. Both parties going back to their corner. Taking a seat on the stool. Take advantage of the blue corner again. Yes, Nikola Todorovic is one of those fighters that is always looking for the knockout, but it always seems that he's looking too much for the knockout and it's really hard to find it because he's too much engaged into power punching. This was a very nice grab, the front yeah. kick, and then counter. Wow, here he did it again. And the KW with full contact, it's allowed to grab for a brief moment, but you cannot hold the leg for too long. One second. Yeah, one second. Todorovic pushing his opponent into the corner again. He missed. He missed with this one and get into the clinch again. Michael Astor needs to do something significant there. Yeah, I have to force the knockout. Otherwise he will lose. Or oh, maybe a knockdown at least. Maybe he'll get to a fourth round if he scores a knockdown. Or two knockdowns. Who knows? He just needs to do something significant. Oh, that was a nice right hand by Todorovic. All night he's been looking for this right hand and now he managed to land it. Now again he landed it good. But Mikhail Astor eating those punches like for breakfast. No problem. Nikola with his mouth wide open, breathing heavily. He seems that he's bloodied a, a little bit. Again, the right hand right on the ear of his opponent. One minute left of the third and final round, possibly. Good knee by Michael Astri here. And now Nikola is marching forward. He wants to have his revenge for that knee. Thirty-five seconds left of round three here. Again, trying for that haymaker, the overhand right, Nikola Todorovic. Fifteen seconds left of round three. Bravo, 
Oh, that was a solid right hand and a left hand. To really end the fight with a bang. Nikola Todorovic, both fighters lifting their hands victoriously, but there could only be one winner. Yeah. Let's see what the judges will say. I think Gukono, but you never know in a fight. Eh? Not a judge. It was a tough, tough fight. Both yeah, fighters, again, really well matched, just like the previous fight. Yeah, yeah. Similar body type. One of them a bit more proactive, the other one reactive. Overall, the judges had a really tough job tonight, huh? <laughs> well, for me, I think Bukon, but you never know, yeah. you know. She make a little more pause and make the pressure move. Well, I see that you should be giving the award not for this fight but for the other fight. So well, I won't take any much more of your time. We're gonna commentate again fight number 10. So I think fight number 10. Yeah. So yeah, we'll see you. I'll see you later. Thank you so much, man. I'm not gonna keep you too much. <laughs> The blue corner and judge number three, 2734, the blue corner and your winner by anonymous decision, the blue corner and Nikola Todorovic from Serbia. The prize will be presented by the four times K1 world champion, Mr. Ernesto Kuz. Nikola will get his champion belt and uh, a cup from the organizers. Let's make some noise for his opponent. He gave him a really good fight. We're waiting for Mr. Kuz to present the awards. One more time, your winner with unanimous decision in the blue corner from Serbia, Nikola Todorovic! The prize is presented by the four-time K1 world champion, Mr. Ernesto Cruz. Coaches, please step in. You get a prize too, yes, thank you, yes. And prizes for his opponent, Michael Astor, who gave a really, really good fight. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you very much. This is the prize for the coaches, and we have a prize for the opponents. Thank you, Mikel. You can now leave the ring. Thank you very much.